Whoa, hey there guys, Super Hamuel here, and welcome. We did Spider-Man 3 for the GBA, we did Spider-Man 2 for the GBA, then I left to go get milk for 10 years, and now it's time- Whoa, smell those pixels! Beautiful. Is- is the real Spider-Man here, before our eyes? I regret to inform you, it's just the Game Boy Advance. Uh, but we are here playing Spider-Man 1 for the GBA. Now, as we listen to this, like, honestly, surprisingly jammy song, uh, I could just play through the game, obviously, like some sort of lame-o, but uh, I decided we're gonna make this a little more fun, because as I mentioned, this is not my first uh, Rodeo with Spider-Man games, so I made Spider-Man Bingo. Now, if you've ever played a Spider-Man game before, especially on the Game Boy Advance, you know that a lot of the same things tend to happen, a lot of the same characters who weren't in the movies tend to be involved, and uh, I just thought it would be fun to see uh, if we could get a bingo. We've got categories like GBA 3D, key cards, black cat, a boss that can't be damaged till he bumps his head, a helicopter chase, uh, let's see, Bonesaw having minions for some reason, that one outdated gay joke from the movie, all sorts of things are here. So take a second, take a look at this beautiful bingo sheet, and then, um, just, just breathe it in, and we'll see if I can get bingo. And if I do get bingo, I'm gonna play the Spider-Man 2 game for the PC on this channel, which is not the really good Spider-Man 2 game for the PS2 and GameCube and whatever. It is a jank mess. So, if I get bingo, we will experience that nightmare together. But enough stalling. Oh, what are the secrets? Ooh, that's exciting. Alright. Let's get going. In a lot of games, um, they won't fit my entire username in there and I have to be super ham. And without the ha without the pun, without the hamule, it just doesn't, doesn't feel right. Alright, here we go. Should I do the voice acting? I'm gonna do the voice acting. Oh, never mind. Uh, he's I, so I can patrol the city and do what I can to keep the people safe. Oh, okay, that was the cutscene. Rescue the hostages. I was gonna put rescue hostages on the bingo card, and then I was like, that's that's too obvious. Okay, let's see. Press A button to jump. Oh, also, when I used to do these. I would have had some experience with the game, but I'm going in completely blind here, so... Oh! Press R? Okay. Oh! <laughs> it's very visceral. Alright. What do we got for graffiti here? Get Hadaga. We got gang. <laughs> Hashtag gangrene. <laughs> Please tell me I'm gonna fight gangrene. <laughs> Isn't that the Powerpuff Girls shtick? Oh well. What's up, everybody? Welcome to gangrene. Maybe that's maybe that's Green Goblin's um, YouTube fans. Willem Dafoe goes in front of the camera. What's up, everybody? Hello, gangrene. Oh, god. I really- I almost put digitized speech on the bingo card, too, and I didn't. That thug, uh... Those are very visceral screams. To attack an enemy, press B. Already figured that out, but thank you. Ooh! <laughs> can we- Can we just talk about the fact that it's- I'm not comfortable with the sounds of murder happening here. Game developer like, alright, we got this game, it's primarily aimed at six-year-olds. What if the thugs screamed like you were separating their head from their body? Every punch. I don't want to think about the fact that this thug has like a family. That's not the... He also has a Molotov nuke, so there's that... Good lord! <laughs> Holy... 
Uh, this, uh, okay, no, it's fine. I, I feel like just, I, I know I'm harping on on this, but I feel like just the, the, the contrast between Pow and Kreesh, which, uh, we did see in Spider-Man 2 way back when, and just the, the visceral, bone-curdling screams of Spider-Man pummeling his enemies is really... This is deep, you know? Okay, reminds me of Hidden Danger. <laughs> the spider sense told me to jump out in a... Hello, hostages. Oh my god. Um, yeah, the contrast of, you know, the cartoony graphics, the creesh, the boom, the pow... What the? Oh yeah, this is this was from... This was in 2. And the, the bone-chilling sounds... Photo taking minigame? Oh my god, that's one of my bingo items. It's it's sort of a mini game. I'm gonna count it. Photo taking mini game. We already got one. That's so exciting. All right, three hostages remain. Uh. Okay. Cool. Yeah, that's that's how that used to work. Can I still go? Yeah, come on, come, Spider-Man, please. Okay. What do these? Gold boys do. I'm glad to see too the uh, eternal kneecap strat. Oh jeez, the eternal kneecap strategy from Spider-Man 2 seems to still function. <laughs> Y'all, listen. I'm not gonna get tired of that. I'm gonna be laughing at. They kidnapped a nun. Oh my god! That's like one of the- listen, I, I understand that these guys are generic thugs with no sense of agency or morality, but like, I feel like there's like a thug Geneva convention. Like, even if you're a dumb video game bad guy whose only purpose is to scream horrendously, um, you don't kidnap a nun! I wonder if there's like take a certain number of pictures in the level. Oh! Nice bounce angle. <laughs> take a picture of these hostages. You think Spider-Man's just like, say cheese, I rescued you. Oh, okay. Just what do you think you were up to, punchy? What am I doing? Looks like a sonic voice. You might hurt somebody falling around like that. I gotta, I gotta pick a good Spider-Man voice. Don't kill me, man! Hey, superheroes don't kill. Against Union Codes. <laughs> Here's my business card. Uh, you know what? Let's see. Ooh, the boss? Will it be Kingpin? Ooh, movie sh- Oh my god. Are those the secrets? Wait, can I see my photos? Oh, that's fun. Oh, I like this. That's cute. I like that. Good job, game developers. That's adorable. I've got zero out of two secrets, though, so... <laughs> okay, I kind of like that line. Ooh, we got different henchmen. Okay, you can't see it, but I'm I'm jamming back here. Is this gonna be the level music? Nice. Oh, I am in danger. Oh, jeez. Agent J, no! Okay, this time instead of de getting defeating them with the power of kneecaps, we have to defeat them with the power of concussions. Yes, 21, my favorite brand. Oh my god. This is a more visceral game than I expected. 
Um, I didn't expect, like, the, the threat of imminent building collapse in loving 3D graphics. Did that just say no? In loving 3D graphics behind me. Oh, jeez. Oh, boy. Uh, poison gas was on the bingo sheet, but I don't have time. This is part of the grand metaphor of this game. You see, the collapsing building represents the way that the repercussions for Spider-Man's actions are following him. Because, if you haven't noticed, because I haven't mentioned it at all, the screams are terrifying. <laughs> okay. I don't... is that bad? You know office steam? You know how you'll just be in your office and... Oh no! Oh no! It's called the- the level is called the cradle will fall? Oh my god. Also, can we talk about- okay, so the green goblin, I'm assuming, did this. He just put his million lackeys in here to die. Like, that guy with the shotgun was just like, yeah, I'm gonna stand here and shoot at Spider-Man's corpse rather than get out of the way. That's... This game is really dark. That <laughs> Nice try. Oh, jeez. I gotta get out of the way. Is there something over here? I don't like it. I don't like it. Oh, jeez. Take a picture. Is there something? Oh, no. Is there something over here? Whoa. Okay. Oh, yikes. This is genuinely stressful. I was gonna play this game. No. I was gonna play this game and I was gonna be like, yeah, this is a Spider-Man game. It's for kids. This is gonna be really easy. And I'm not saying it's not, but just like... I- I feel genuine stress. <laughs> oh no. Especially for the second level, I'm... Sort of- oh jeez. I- Maximum skill. You all wish you were Spider-Man professionals, just like me. I just saw the frame rate chug a little bit, so my apologies if my absolute potato computer uh, does not like recording this. Okay. We're in the ducts. Still don't really know what the gold boys do, but it's okay. Okay, you guys waited until I was there. Shield web? Ooh. Oh, I didn't even notice you can get, like... That's the second time that's happened. I didn't even notice you can get, like, different power-ups for your web. That's kind of neat. I'm enjoying playing this game partially because maybe you've seen, there's like a channel that I like on YouTube. I think he's, he's called like Mini Me or something? I don't remember his actual channel name, but oh no, the stress. Um, oh, they give you an extra life if you get enough of those, that's cool. But um, he does like reviews on like older port, like ports of um, like, oh, here's the DS version of this game that was for PS2, like how do they do on this one? And like... People are gonna remember the the Spider-Man 2 movie game, or sorry, the Spider-Man 1 movie game for like PS2 or whatever. I am just running through, I don't even... <laughs> I'm more afraid of the building collapse than I am of the poison gas. At least the game's been very generous with lives! Um... But, uh... Like, I feel like this is the kind of thing that's kind of unappreciated. Like, people worked on this. Like, they worked really hard on this, you know? Pete, somebody, like, went to school for years to be a game developer, and they made this little, you know, quote-unquote throwaway game. And I think it's fun to see... Why did I do that? Leave a comment below. Tell me why I did that. <laughs> Explain to me my thought process. Um... <laughs> See, okay, 
adding to the weird darkness of this game, the signs that just say NO in capital letters in the background. Is this like Spider-Man's fever dream? Secret unlocked for photographing. Oh, I got movie shot too. Oh, and I got secret one. I don't know what it was. Let's look at our photos. Okay. Do Spider-Man remembers the time that he knelt down and lovingly inspected the forearms of this this villain? Guy was like, Spider-Man, I'm shredded. He's like, dude, you are. And then he punched him into the electricity. Spider-Man remembers the time that he was in event. And Spider-Man remembers the time. <laughs> Spider-Man remembers the time that he examined a different part of this thug. So, that was part one of Let's Play Spider-Man number one for the Game Boy Advance. Thank you so much for watching. As a YouTuber, I am contractually obligated to tell you to like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you in just two days for part two. Catch you next time.